Hi there, and welcome to this week's Leading with Purpose Friday Digest. We are talking this week about the art of strategic leadership. And this is often a very important topic that we engage our clients with, just because we know how important it is to purposefully help your team move forward in a way that makes sense and can not only provide direction, but also inspire your team. And so there are five core components that that we often touch on. And the first of those is the vision. And this is where that artistic factor always comes in, right? It's the ability to tell a story of where you would expect or hope um, and want the organization to get to in three to five years. And this is often up to a CEO, an owner, um, someone, or a few folks at the top levels of an organization to come up with this vision and really be specific about where the organization will be in terms of geographic footprint, um, the type of business that they will be doing, the type of customers that they might have at that point, what kind of culture could an employee expect to experience in three to five years, et cetera. So those are some of the factors that the vision lays out. And it really does kind of set that point out in the future that then drives all of these other pieces. The second is goals. So being very specific and clear on the goals that the organization will achieve in various time pieces to get to that broader vision out in that three or five year time frame. What are the specific actions that the organization is going to be taking and who will be doing what um, within those goals and objectives in order to keep the organization and, and each team within the organization moving towards the vision. The third point is around resources. An organization cannot function, you know, much like not having gas in the tank, if the proper resources aren't in place. And that could be literally physical resources, um, the plant, um, machinery, equipment, transportation vehicles, etc. It can also be the people. Um, do you have the right people in the right seats? Is the talent of the organization sufficient for today and tomorrow? And also obvious things like money, um, customer relationships, maybe even brand awareness. Th those are all resources that strategically need to be considered and managed well and judiciously to give that organization the gas it needs to get to that vision. Um, accountability is a huge piece of any strategic plan, and it should be a non-negotiable in that um, both for the leaders and the employees that they are leading, clear expectations and feedback loops, great communication, all pieces that lead to ownership of, of goals and tasks, and also ensure that um, if we are meeting those goals and tasks, great. If we're not, let's talk about why and readjust or address it. Without accountability, many organizations stumble and wallow, for lack of a better word, um, and are unable to meet their strategic initiatives or goals. And finally, a strategic leader needs to have or focus on risk management. Again, keeping an eye on all of the elements in their environment um, externally as well as internally that could derail the strategic plans. So these five pieces, again, the vision, the goals, resources, strong accountability, and risk management are essential to strategic leadership. And we at Dame Leadership work really hard to help our clients and inf individuals who could be our clients um, unpack each of those carefully and, and thoughtfully and in a way that's meaningful to their organization. So if you have any questions about how we can help you do that, you can read more in the blog attached here or contact us for a really robust conversation. And we look forward to engaging with you in the near future. And as always, our goal is to develop better and more purposeful leaders. Take care.